All right, hello everybody, and welcome back to Kirby Superstar Ultra. We haven't played this in a little bit. Uh, it's we... been a week. Exactly, it's been a bit. Oh, I need to move my mouse. Yeah, go ahead and do your click. But yeah, um, we're gonna do the arena today, apparently. So, you remember the arena from, uh... The new from, one? Um, Forgotten Land, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah where it's stupid difficult. Well, no, not that one. The ones before that. So, like, oh. the beginner and intermediate difficulties. <sighs> no? Sort of. Well, yeah, this is basically what we're going up against right now. So you can so you can run into any power-up and you will instantly get it. Every power-up in the game is here. And in order to respawn, you need to stand a little bit further. It will tell us how many fights we are in, and then it will also tell us um, who our next fight is. So, for example, our first fight is versus Lolo Lolo -Lo and Lolo. -Lo. So, you got it? Yep. Well, when you're ready, jump into the thing. Yep, jumping into Star. Oh, God, I'm not again. Got him. So that's broken. Yeah. Got him. Yeah, you two shot with that. Yeah. Um, now here's the thing. As with the other arena in Forgotten Lands, we only have limited healing, so. Right. You need to conserve those as much as possible. I will just go and grab new abilities as we go on. But you getting a new ability doesn't do anything, so you should probably stick with Hammer. I just need to keep quick swapping so that I can take damage and, and continue on. Alright. Now, it's best we just continue doing this because we're going to be here for a while. This one, if I remember correctly, has about... In the tree. Uh, no. I think it has like 20 ish fights, but I don't quite recall. Alright, let's go. Anyway, whilst we are doing that, uh, we're also going to discuss the Nintendo Direct, or at least try to, and see how well that goes for us. Ow. Stuck in the bird. Remember that you have a defend. You just kill it. Hey. <laughs> yeah, chat. So the director was. Uh, I'm gonna get some health. Yes, you should probably go and grab one of those. Oh, yeah, yeah, I can heal so you. So let's see. Yeah, continue on. The first game that was announced, Mario and Luigi is coming back with a new game called The Brothership. I'm curious that's going to be because there's not been a Mario and Luigi since the 3DS days because that company was dumb as shit because they made 3DS games after the Switch was out. Why the fuck they thought that was a good idea? I have no idea. Alright. That said, um, it is interesting, so... It's good. Let's see how it goes. Yeah, it's fine to be good. I don't mind a new Mario game of any kind, really. Yeah. Like, it looks pretty cool, too. So I don't know how much of it is, like, just me seeing a Mario game. Backing off. And being like, oh, yeah. Like, I'm like just thinking that it looks good on a basic level. That said, it does look appreciate that. Now... Yeah, so Hi, we're Greg. back in the Warp Star, so... Oh. Are you winning? We just started. Um, we're <laughs> nearly dead, and it's our- and it's only Area 5 out of 20-ish. So no, you are not winning. No. Okay, we have one more, I think. So just follow my ship around. 
No, we have two more, I think. So yeah, Brothership looks interesting, and then there was a collection of... How do you even describe this? It was like a bunch of games that you can get, or like you can speedrun particular levels of. Ah! What's it called? And, it was like, and it's like a time trial thing. It's a uh, Nintendo World Championships NES edition. So oh, you can do, like, they're bringing NES those games. back. They're bringing those back. Yeah, something like that. So I saw like an Ice Climbers level, I think. Yeah, a lot of those were on Wii U, so they're just bringing it to Switch now. Really, you're a boss? Well, I mean, technically speaking, he does count as a boss. Now, there's an actual boss if you were complaining so much about it. Uh, alright. Um, stuff. afterward... Oh, well, we get another sword, I guess. After that was a fairy tale game, a sequel, which I didn't even know they made a first, or a, an original for, so that was interesting. Uh, I learned something today, or that day. But, uh, yeah. Actually, did you know there was a second fairy, or like a fairy tale game, Greg, on the thing? Or on no. The Switch? I was so, not, in fact, aware. Watch it. Watch it. I'm trying to leave. Thank you. <laughs> Maybe I should be Kirby during these sections. Maybe. No, this is fine. I'm just gonna go with Mario. If you think we can survive this, I would suggest going, because this one wasn't particularly hard. This yeah. the reactor that was. Matt, when I Oh yeah, that's right. You can't you can't just hide away. It's not gonna help either of us. You've done it. No thanks to you. Anyway. <laughs> So remember how this one works. We just stay in front of the reactor core and it'll probably blow itself up the side from the fire. Ow. Matt, you have to cooperate here too, remember? After that was uh, Fantasia Neo Dimension, which looked very generic, all things like generic RPG, yes. Nothing really stood out to me about that one, but, uh... Oh. That's what I was doing, I was trying to get out of there. But yeah, so that one exists. Yeah. And then, uh, I want to get a hammer as well in a second. The one afterwards is really interesting, though. So, uh, Mio's Memories of Orbit looks like, um, looks like another one of those platformers that I happen to really like playing. So, I'm eagerly awaiting to see how that one goes. Nice, we one shot that boss. Yep. All right, so we have nine more, so we end at 20 exactly. Alright. What else happened? Um, let's see. Oh, he's first attack. Oh, he's gonna do take less damage. Um, there was a Hello Kitty game that happened. So it's like Animal Crossing, but Hello Kitty. Okay. Don't ask me as if I have any idea. Matt, I feel like you would get more mileage just holding down the defense button. Mm. You do remember how to defend, right? 
this. Alright, cool. Well, look, I mean that you need to help me, too, a little bit. No, no, you're saying no, that you would get more than, or out of that than just trying to run constantly. Nice. Um, after that was Looney Tunes Sports. Sure. Don't know why that's a thing, but uh, it is. And uh, yeah, so you can be your favorite Looney Tunes characters in what basically look like uh, Nickelodeon sports or Wii Sports. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then uh, there's an Among Us. Date for Switch, which I thought already came out for PC for a bunch of new roles. Yeah, thinking about it, I'm pretty sure that came out for PC already. Yeah. It'll take some longer to know for console. They are like four people. I guess. Ouchie. Yeah, we're gonna have a bit of trouble doing uh, the. Uh, Full power shaft with this. Okay. Um, next sure is a game called Farmagia where you apparently farm monsters, but it looks like Fairy Tale because it's the Fairy Tale designer, I think. Oh. So, nothing, it just looks like the fairy tale game all over again. Maybe it Holy is. Shit. You know, it, it's been a while since I fought Deity, so I didn't know that Deity did that much contact damage. You're alive! Uh, you might want to, you might want to take the mirror, all things considered. Because mirror's, uh, defense is pretty strong, from what I recall. Also, go grab that, uh... That tomato? tomato up there. Yeah. So, yeah, Farmagia was... very underwhelming, because I just felt like I was looking at the fairy tale game again. Uh, Donkey Kong Country Returns is Reporting it from back. the Wii and 3DS to Switch. Yay! Which, finally. I don't mind, but I would rather have a new game. So, unrelated um, to anything, but when you bring up contact damage, I always think of Zelda now. Great. Wow, we are actually chipping the heck out of this boss just by guarding. Um, then we have a Dragon Quest 3, 1, and 2 remake. And I say 3, 1, and 2 in that order, because apparently that's the order in which the events of the game are in. Dragon Quest 312. Um, let's see. There's a Funko Pop game. That's why. Why? Because somebody really wanted it, I guess. This Funko Pop Who is in this person? Who is this person who wanted this? I want a word. Yeah, so I think I saw... I definitely saw a zombie person together with the, the, in the trailer. Okay. Or like a bunch of people that definitely should not be together in a, in a game. But, uh... Wow, why did you let go of card? I didn't. Well, I... Well, that's great, but we do actually need to beat that. Oh. To get the rewards. Shit. Yes. Would you like to switch positions? Yeah. Would you like to switch to defense um, position? Now, how are we supposed to do this exactly? I think you need to mess with the config so that I can control the curve. You're, you're good. I'm not moving anything. All right, let me swatch these controls. Input and hotkeys. 
So it's a PS5. Oh, wait, the game is like gonna crash because of that. Oh. Well, while we're doing that, we can talk a little bit more. Yeah, we can talk uh, about the direct more while I get this up and running. Yeah, hold on. Let me check the direct. Yeah, it was Jaws and uh, Back to the Future. Very relevant franchises. And uh, Five Nights at Freddy's and some other random shit. What? That was great. Um, That's stupid. And then there was a thing for a game called Dempa Men, or The Dempa Men, uh, or The New Dempa Men, it. sorry. Why can't uh, I switch this? Okay, then you see if you can do anything. No, you're still on oh, two, wait, that's hold. annoying. Oh, wait, there we go. Oh, right. All my controls are fucked up. So my Wazda is my movement, I think, and yeah, right fix is your, my... Fix your, fix your shit. All right. So press A. That's whatever. Oh, A, this one. Up. Okay, hit. Oh, fine. We'll do that. Up. All right. No, the, those are fine. Everything else is okay. What? Are the controls still swapped? Challenge. No, Matt. Some what? Some of the button controls aren't right. Hold on. Go back. Go back to Gone Fig on my side. Uh. Yeah, what the heck? Is it because it's on PS5 controller? Or... No, that doesn't make sense. Yeah, I unplugged my controller. Oh no, there, there you go. Now let me unplug my controller. Well, I mean, you could play on keyboard and I'll just carry. That's true. Alright. What happens if you play on keyboard? It's working. Are you... No, but I'm nope. not connected. Nope. Okay, what if I... No. I don't appear to be able to control the uh, with my controller. No. Uh, can we connect my controller by any chance? PS4 controller. Okay. That's connected. Right, change that to keyboard. This is PS5 controller. There we go. Oh, wait, why are there, like, zero controls for this fucker? Are you serious? Well, I I can control mine now. I, I can't. Let me just look at the controls. Nope. Um, I have to fix this. I mean, well, yeah, because you probably made this instance after you started this, uh, after you started the game, so you didn't edit all the, or carry over the controls. Yeah. Also. I'm sure this is only gonna go well. Anyway, uh... Next one is a Metal Slug Attack Tower Defense game where you make Metal Slug units and they go around and uh, blow things up, I guess. Not quite sure how that all works, but it certainly exists. And then... And hit start to skip it, please. Thank you. Yeah. All right, let's see. All right. Can you create uh, me? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> some of my buttons are not in the right position. I'm gone. Yes, I know. Um, can you? No, you can't do reconfigure my keybinds. Oh, well, whatever. Uh, are you good with that then? I can't. Uh, I gotta I swap work. some of these controls. These controls are not good. Actually, this is fine. It's jump and attack, jump and attack, jump and attack. Right, now it's then. jump is now square and jump and attack is now X for some reason. I'm on the tree. Yeah, Whiskey Woods is actually a target box, I guess, or a mm. contact box. 
Anyway, uh, after that, uh, apparently Darkest Dungeon 2 is coming to Switch. I thought it was out for a Switch already, but... Hey. If it works, it works. Um, there's a new Die Sega game. Mm. Yes, thank Hold on, move. Ah, fuck. Whoops. Oh, well. That's your hammer, bro. Yeah, it's fine. Well, DG's next. You stun knocking his ass? Yeah, DG doesn't attack very fast. As long as you stay a little bit away from him, he literally can't hit you. But, uh, yeah, so, uh, it's called Phantom Brave the Lost Hero, though I don't really recall a lot about what was in that one. It was at least okay. And then, I think there's another thing for the people that, uh, made the... You remember that Disney explo exploration game? Nope. Game Infinity? No, not that one. The like the one that had the cartoonish variants of all the characters. Oh, okay. Like uh, uh, like uh, Disney Illusion Island. No, I don't remember anybody? that at all. Oops, wrong button. But uh, yeah, so that exists. Um, Are you sure? Sure. Uh, there's a new or. Er, a remake of the old Marvel vs. Capcom games, and then a couple other Marvel Capcom, uh, what do you call them? Properties to added to the, uh, shop. Yeah, so the fighting game fans are like, oh, holy shit! It's not yeah, Switch exclusive, by the way. Um, there's a new Mario Party that actually has new content! It's been ages! Yeah, we've had a new Mario Party in three years. It comes out in October, I saw that. That looks fun. It's like five new boards, two returning boards. Something like that. Uh, and then next up Wait, is... Wait, I need to get more health I... again. Next one is one that I'm quite interested in. It's a actually Legend of Zelda Zelda game. You can play as Zelda now. Yeah, you can play as Zelda and build shit. It's it's basically Legend of Zelda if uh, you use Minecraft physics to solve It looks problems. like it's the, um, the, whatchamacallit, what was the Switch game, or what was the Game Boy game they ported over a few years ago, or they remade? What was it again? Um, the whatchamacallit. The one where there's the wind fish? Yeah, so... It looks like it's that engine. Uh, well, yeah, it does. Which is cool. The thing is, is that... Like, just the con the concept of it looks a lot cooler than one would have expected for it, I guess. I don't remember you being able to stand somewhere on this. I guess that one's easier with a ranged attack. Uh, Thank you. Um, so yeah, I'm actually kind of interested in that one. Yeah, me too. We still need to play the Windfish one, though. I own that and I didn't play it. I did look through the art book, though, when that came out, because it came with an art book. Like, I got an actual physical reward. It wasn't like, a, oh, download this, like, PDF. It was, like, actually, like, a real thing that you can, like, look at. It's really cool. I'll show you guys one of these days. I gotta find it. It was really, it was really okay. good looking. Why don't you go get some more HP? And then, let's see. You can get HP, too. There's two tomatoes up top. Go get the tomatoes. Well, I can survive another bit, so I don't need to get it's it. It's the computer virus. Yeah, I know. I'm... I know how to fight the computer virus. Oh, okay. 
This is well, a to cool be fair, concept. I know how to fight most. But yeah, so uh, Lego Horizon Zero That's Dawn being ported, I guess, and, as well. And Stray are being ported. So uh, those are things. That's true. Well, Stray, dude, I looked at the graphics for the Switch version. Jesus Christ. Not great. Oof. Yeah, that sounds about right. Like, it's a PS5 game, man. It's, uh... When does that stop Nintendo from having crappy graphics? Could be worse, could be Pokemon. Also true. You are uh, kidding me. <laughs> there you go. Um, uh, next one. There is a Hobbit game that's coming out. And specifically, Hobbits, where... You're gonna go get the... Tomatoes? It's Galactic Nova. Yeah, I know. It's not exactly Galactic Nova is one of my hardest ones. But yeah, so there's like a Animal Crossing Hobbit game now, I guess. I saw or, that. Yeah. Maybe it's like Stardew Valley, I'm not sure. Stardew Valley. So, if you wanted to live out your dreams of being a Hobbit, uh, good on you, I guess. What if I don't, though? Well, you should have started dreaming then you should, about uh, Then you can play Middle Earth Shadow of Mordor from, like, six years ago. Actually, more like almost ten now. Thank you. Old. Thank you for making me feel old. I mean, those games are pretty old, right? Yes. What was the last one? Was it Middle Earth Shadow of Mordor? It. Was that the last one? Let me Google the Middle Earth Shadow. Let me Google Middle Earth games. Middle Earth... Shadow War. Is that the most recent one? Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's 2017, so it's fucking seven years ago, actually. Holy shit, that game is old. That's like a mid gen PS4 game. That means it can literally run on any computer, pretty much, so that's good. Oh, that's nice to know, I guess. Like, if you want, you can run it. Actually, the funny thing is, they have a. They, there's that Nemesis system, the Nemesis system that's in that game where you can, like, can. Get enemies to like sign on to your team, and um, they patented it so no one can use it for like another decade almost. Because Warner Brothers is that much of a dick. I freed you. Honestly, I feel like they mishandled the Nemesis quite a bit though. Yeah, well, it's patented so no one can even try to use it anyway. So, so thanks, buddy. I'm actually gonna do plasma for this one. But yeah, so there's a Just Dance that's coming out again because people are Right on, Clockwork from Ubisoft. More mid shit that peaked with the with the uh, Connect. Because the Connect was the best way to do it. Because there's literally no like controller you have to deal with. Yeah. Um. Uh, let's see. The next one. Any more health? Was. Yeah, you're fine. I hate this one. I hate the chameleon. I'm dead. He ate me. Goodbye. Rip. Sorry. Nice. Um, I'm gonna do the next couple in the order that they were announced, I think. Can I be brought back to life, please? Yeah, give me a second. Can you charge this one? You need to move your, uh, like, control stick around a bunch. A lot, a lot, I mean. It might just be easier for you to go and get something else, honestly. Alright. 
Um, next was a game from the Danganronpa developer, I think, called The Hundred Line Last World. It's another school, but this time you're fighting against alien invaders for some reason. I said Danganronpa, people were like, why isn't it Danganronpa? I'm like, okay. I mean, the Danganronpa people are always gonna be, why isn't it Danganronpa, so... You learn to just kind of ignore that after a while. Nice. But I like the idea of it more than I think I like the execution, personally. But it's kind of an RTS looking thing, so it is what it is. Uh, hey, you want to switch to Cutter? Yeah. RTS, and it's just not my thing. I find, I find it kind of... Well, I don't I don't think it's quite RTS so much as it's like, uh... It's like the XCOM system from what it looks like, but... Yeah, like XCOM slash, um, Mario and Rabbids. Yeah, something like that, yeah. I like the Mario and Rabbids. We should go through that once we get, like, more free game. Like, we can... I didn't beat the first one ever, so we can play that and I can try to beat it finally. It's actually quite difficult. You taking that hammer? Well, well, I was going to, and then apparently I didn't eat it. Ah! I beat him. He's dead. Dead, motherfucker. Um, let's see. Oh boy, it's Heavy Lobster. That's gonna be fun. Uh, next is Romancing Saga, which is... It touted itself as some kind of, like, uh, generation-spanning uh, RPG or something like that. So, so it's well, like that's a Chrono Trigger. And it's not quite Chrono Trigger, or I don't even think it's trying to be Chrono Trigger, but more so, like, you are... Like, you are designing and making choices for a kingdom to try and save it from a grave threat over multiple generations of this lineage of... So it's Infinity Blade, kind of, except only the sword fighting was Infinity Blade. Do you guys remember Infinity yes. Blade? That game was yes. great. That game was so good. I still have it. Yeah, but it doesn't matter really? anything anymore, though. That's what sucks. I... No, I, I mean, I still have it on a device that starts up. Oh, nice. That's it. Granted, it has to be plugged in because the battery doesn't work anymore, but... Okay. Nice. Ow, why am I so jumpy? Jesus. I remember causing the data type to overflow for the, uh, what was it, the, uh, the enchantment or enhancement or whatever oh, for nice. the... Because I was really, really patient. <laughs> Oops, sorry. Mm, Let's only kill the other one. Ah. I'm shielding this dumb. I get for trying to help you. <laughs> yep. Oops. <laughs> Brother, that was on you. Yeah, no, that was totally on me. <laughs> uh, how many did we beat? Fucking 16 again. Yeah. Man. We're almost there. We just need to stop dying to random shit. Alright. Let's. Well, at least we got Galactic Nova again. Yeah, I thought that I could jump out of the way, and then I just threw myself in the angle of it. So I probably should have just walked instead. Oh, we're starting off this easy. Yeah. I do like how it's random. It's not. It's, uh, well, the, you mean the boss fight order? Yeah. I think it's to stop people from being able to just, like, Jesus. breeze through the fight. Yeah. Because, like, there's a lot of... 
Like, if you have a consistent strategy, then you can use the consistency of it all. Like they put more a, thought into this than I have figured. We one cycled that. I mean, to be fair, this is the first time I think they ever did this. Like, we've done... There were boss rushes before, I think. But nothing to the arena stand. Ah. Okay, I didn't realize it started. I'm trying to... I'm gonna get some uh, red rock. By the way, Greg, voice. can you uh alert in the alert? Yeah. Alright. Hey! That was mean. He's a judo man. He does judo things. Oh boy, Dino Blade, our favorite enemy. <laughs> um, let's see, where was I? Oh yeah, Switch Sports is getting an update. It's getting Way basketball! Yeah, because that was definitely something that needed to come out literally right the fuck now. I literally saw a video on it. That was like like two weeks ago. That so it was like, yeah, this game's like done. Like Nintendo abandoned it, was, it. It was done a long while ago. They just decided to try and revive it again. A couple more people. Well, Thank they you. still could. And it really, I don't think, is gonna pan out for them. No. At this point, I'm just gonna go back to- I'm just gonna keep playing Wii Sports on Steam Deck. Yeah. This is a more uh, fun game, see. and it's also like... I don't have to worry about like, updating and like, dumb currency shit and like, costume. I don't care. I just wanna play fucking bowling. I- I legitimately do not give a shit. Oh, fuck it out. Like, yeah, I don't- I don't- Like, I don't- I don't, like, care about, like, the- the thing. Ouchies. That's a good shot. Nice shot. Signature technique. Okay, it's time to not die for stupid reasons again. Alright, um, let's see. Next up, uh, Luigi's Mansion 2, I believe, is coming. To... Yeah, they gave a release date for it. I... What am I doing wrong? You are large. That is it. Um, so yeah. And then there's, like, a bunch of... Game Boy games coming, so there's, um... Link and the Four Swords, or whatever the hell. Oh, nice more Game Boy stuff. And then there's a San uh, Metroid Zero mission coming out. Oh, that's cool. Here, come down. Well, I was going to say come down here so I can get rid of you and then we can preserve the, the, the hammer, but alright. You just teabag the bastards. Um, oh yeah, there's a new TMNT game that's coming. Yeah, that was announced a little while ago. It's kind of like a Super Nintendo S game. Oh, that's good. Ricochet. Yeah, so that one exists. And then the last big one... I did say Luigi's Mansion 2, yeah. You did say Luigi's Mansion. It's getting ported from 3DS to Switch. Well. Oh well. <laughs> It's fine. Sure you're on Cutter? No, I'm getting Cutter. Just getting a feel for that one. Alright. No, I don't uh, want The big controls. one is uh, Metroid Prime... Or Metroid, Metroid Prime, Prime 4. 4. Finally My literally, like, seven-year-old fucking pre-order on Amazon that was automatically 30% off because everyone was doing that because Best Buy was doing that will finally pay off. I will now be able to get a game that is... Worth six, probably seventy bucks. I will now be able to get for forty-five, which is hilarious to me. Like they're the pre-ordering that years ago, paid off. I saw a lot of people on Amazon are like tweeting out the same thing. They're like, "Yeah, I made a pre-order on Amazon years ago, and I'm getting it like dirt cheap compared to like the retail price." Oh my god, he punched the shit out of me. Then you punch the shit out of both of us. You look at my HP. Yeah. Nope. Oh. 
Goodbye. We'll hit a rock. I have faded away. Goodbye, crew world. Now you're playing like a Smash player now. I didn't give you the worst power up. I mean, <laughs> that's, I guess, it like... works. Well, so here's the thing. I said this before, and I'll say it again. Rock is completely invincible when the rock activates. So I would like to be alive, please. Dang it, Dwayne, <gasps> stop alive. being invincible. This doesn't make any sense. But, uh, yeah, so anything stick out to you for the Nintendo Direct? Mario! Metroid! Oh, Christ. Other uh, things that start with M. Not Metroid, other M. Not that Wii game. No one likes that game. But I've never actually played a Metroid game before, so... Maybe you should start. I do own the... Uh, I, I did buy the remaster. And I own the uh, original trilogy on Wii U. Like I bought the digital when they were doing like porting Wii games to Wii U for ten dollars. I bought Metroid Prime. Like it was the entire trilogy for ten bucks. So like I do legally own that. I just have to deal with my Wii U. When it comes to just you know, fucking emulate the things, so who cares? And if I'm gonna play the new one, I'm gonna play the new one in HD. I think that came out like. Did that come out this year? I think it came out this year, right? Or it came out like February or something? Great, can you Google when they released the Metro Prime Remastered? Was that this year? Ooh. Hammer. Hammer. Check hammer. Well, you're gonna be the one with the hammer because I had to grab the sword, I think. Yep, yep, yep. Then I'm fine with this. Metroid Prime Remastered was last year. Really? Oh shit. Because Swarm was this year. I did buy it. And why? You can only jump? Bye. Yeah, I think that kills me. Ah, fuck. <laughs> I've still never figured out how to quite uh, beat that tornado attack. I think you need to go behind them, but hey. Yeah. All right. Uh, I one think we got shot. time for one yeah, more shot. Let's try one more shot. If not, oh well. Well, we'll just have to do it next week. Yeah. Oh boy! You'll get it eventually. The first one's the whale. <sighs> oh Jesus! Wait, I want to not have this. Well, then go choose a power. Where's this here? The other side, hmm? Wait, where are my bombs not working? Sure, you don't want something else like Beam or Yo Yo. Or even Mirror. Wait, like, I can't. Oh, there we go. Okay. I figured it out. I figured it out. Okay. Alright. Let's try not to die. <laughs> yeah, of all the parts, I figured that this and one other part would probably be the ones that took us the longest. Though my controls being mixed up was not the reason I was expecting this one to be as difficult as it is. Um, but, uh, yeah. Oh well, yeah, so, uh, Hololive is having the next generation, or next English generation, debuting today. Yes. One of them is British. And you're just like his Brits. I mean, I find British people amusing, I suppose. They are amusing. I love that they're bitching about 70 degrees heat. 
And they're oh, that like, sounds oh, like me. No, yo, Greg, yo, they're yeah. bitchy. No, Greg, like they're like, oh, it's too hot. Yeah. You uh, you talked to the wrong person about heat. In Greg, both well, Greg, it was 90. It's gonna be 90 tomorrow here. Yes. Which is why I'm glad I will be indoors. Brits have no right to complain about semi- For British people, just get a fucking AC! I looked at Lowe's, and like, you can get like a window AC system that's apparently pretty damn good for less than $200. It's not expensive to get AC. You can't- yeah, a whole home- In Britain, they don't know that ACs exist because they don't usually use them. Yeah, and like, maybe- yeah, maybe a whole home system is expensive, but just like a window system? Being less than 200 bucks, just get a window system. It's not that fucking What's difficult. What's a window system? What's an AC? Do you mean an armored core? <laughs> it's literally not that hard. I do not so, understand. Back away. Back away. It's literally, like, not difficult. I do not understand how they are, like, complaining. They have no right to complain about... 70 degree heat when it was literally almost 130 today. When it was 130 today in Dubai. In Saudi Arabia. Look, if you're not habituated to the heat, then it just kills you. Straight you're up. You're habituated to the heat, you bitch. Just get AC. If you're not habituated, you're a bitch. Just become a more of a bitch. Is what I yeah, just, just heard. We have tech... We have technology. We have technology. We literally have technology that makes it so you can just not feel like shit. We have AC. We have heaters. This isn't 18 fucking 95 where you had to literally light a fire to stay warm in England. There's heaters exist. AC exists. Why are we exists. talking about heaters now? Just go, like, if you're feeling hot, just go sit in your fucking vehicle. Your car Just probably sit has in AC. your vehicle and your sit in your vehicle in your car park and you run and, the and, engine and, and die. And she just love their like oh it's, no yes. not in your garage, Greg. Like in the like sit in your driveway. Unless you have an EV, then you can sit inside. It's totally fine. Because you can't get carbon monoxide poisoning from an EV. Well, you probably can, That's but they want you to think. I have an EV. I'm good. Right. Like, legit, just get AC. It is not difficult to get an AC. You don't have to buy something that's, like, top of the line or, like, in your entire house. Just get enough to, like, fucking not, like, be warm. It's not that difficult. Like, it's less than $200 for AC. It isn't expensive. If you're retrofitting your house, yeah, that's expensive. But if you're not, if you're just trying to cool down like an apartment or something, just get a window AC. He's cheesing this. A terrible start. Uh, well, sorry, my work phone is I have no idea who's sending messages this late. We every time we get an email from Australia. Fuck me. Tornado is like the worst of Meta Knight's attacks, honestly. Oh, jeez. Alright, 
right. He exploded. Well, that's one of our harder fights down, at least. Yeah, we're probably gonna want Yo-Yo for this one. I think I can do... Lola and Lala without uh, healing for this. Okay, can you say that we're delayed a bit, too? Sure. Oh, okay, you can't guard over the, uh, the hole, I guess. That's why you died that one time. Because I got shoved off. Do you want HP? Mmm, yeah, I'm gonna grab an HP now. Now this one, if I don't jump, we should be able to do from here. I'll pull off the right attack. There we go. You can just duck, you don't have to take damage. No, this has extended hitbox, so why I keep getting hit? There we go. I had an idea. Bye bye. Try not to get hit. Wow, what a revolutionary idea that. It was Greg who said uh, that. I'm gonna grab the maximum just to be safe here. I do not trust this. I hate Wham Bam Rock! <laughs> Don't worry, Wham Bam Rock hates you too. I mean, yeah, it's trying to kill me. So, Nintendo always makes enemies with, like, hands or whatever. I mean, it's a hands on experience. Okay, E3 demo man. Hey, I was not in range of that. Hands disagree. Hands can get smacked. I'm gonna break dancing. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Okay, cool. I broke out of it. <laughs> nice. Uh, that could have been bad. <laughs> yeah. All right. Hit bosses. We should be all right for that. You want to change power-ups? Uh, yeah. All right, let's go then. Oh, yeah, I saw, um... Molly went, and she saw Sunday and went, Ah! Like, like, there was a thing that was like, why does like sleep? And she's like, no, I want to be asleep. I want to be asleep with Sunday. I like Sunday's plan. I... okay. It's Molly, dude. This girl is down atrocious. Yeah, it's very funny. And I saw, uh... Uh... Boot Hill's, uh, VA, Andrew, his wife, who's playing Yunli, he... she apparently was in the chat when he, um... I uh, was looking at the Firefly trailer, and he yeah. paused on the uh, on Firefly as well. Chess, because he's trying to pause on just the scene. Yeah. And she's like, "So your chat told I checked in, and your chat told me something was going on that I should come talk to you." And she's like, "Yeah, something about that you keep like it zoomed in on that." And he's like, "No, look." And he tried to show with Budo. She's like, "Yeah, it's still showing on his chest." He's like, "That's a zipper." She's like, "Okay." Nice. Do you want fire or no? Fire must have hot fire. Oh. Okay. No, it was just so funny. Like, it's on the Himiko Star Rail channel as usual. Hmm. There, was, there was sword.
Evil Knight gets the first attack. He raises his defense. Matt, what are you doing? Matt is having the fun. Good job, Matt. Ooh. soaking him because I'm not doing any damage there, so. Alright. The dragon attacks! Uh, now we go this way. I keep accidentally jumping instead of attacking because of the button configs. It's petrified! Song that will get copyright struck. So what bosses haven't we killed? I don't think we've done Chameleon this run, and I don't think we've done Dynamite yet, right? No. And we haven't done DDD, but DDD is DDD. Yeah. Yeah. Well, there it's Seek of the Devil. I'd rather not risk dying to get my power. Uh-oh. Watch it. Yeah. Oh, nice. Probably oh. taking a little bit extra damage there if you hadn't done that. Alright, we need to just stand still. I repeat, stand still. Ish. And guard. We also need to guard. Hey, wait, hold on a minute. I can generate charge by defagging. Jump. Or that one. If I teabag hard enough, I wait, generate wait. electricity! Um, I think this will... Uh... Bye. What? Well, thanks, man. <laughs> we had one job! Look, oh, you know how that usually ass. goes. What? Why did I even reflect that? You didn't, it didn't, just didn't go anywhere. Well, I know, but why didn't it reflect on the, on the cannon, is what I'm saying. The, the last couple of times that happened, it reflected on the cannon. Uh, what? Uh, yeah, what? angles are odd sometimes. Case in point. Jump a bit. Literally one hit, come on. Yeah, it's four. Final god. That one's just annoying. Can I be brought back to life? 
Well, this is a problem. I kind of liked having put plasma. <laughs> well. Hopefully this doesn't go poorly. I'm sure it won't. Alright, I got right trees. side. Okay, Heavy Lobster is second to last. Alright, let's go. Ouch. <laughs> Why did it do that? Game. I mean, it does a lot of things. He has zero HP left. Alright, All right. well, oh. here's our final boss. Alright, you wanna heal us? Well, I mean, we have two maximum potatoes for a reason. Alright, let's go. Alright. <sighs> this is 19th, by the way. Yep, this is the last one. We beat this, we win. Right, yep, that's why. No, I thought, or I seem to recall that, uh, not, uh, damaging you if the seed was gone. I guess I was wrong. I'm just DP. Me and Minecraft be like. What? Why? Why me? Why not? Pat, you're popular. Oh, okay, that goes past guard, I guess. Oh, there's a power boost. I believe in you guys. Nice, 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 nice. 
Yeah. They told you. Champion, 16 minutes, 50 seconds, and 74 seconds. All right. Hurrah. All right, work. save, please. For the love of God. We can play Megaton Punch. Yay. So, uh, yeah, that's the arena done. We'll get back to why we need to do that later, but next one. Well, so here's the thing, right? Meta Nightmare Ultra is basically the four, the first six games all over again, right? Oh. Helper to Hero, on the other hand, is the arena, but you can only be one power up. Oh. So it's more whichever one you want to do first, rather than, uh, <sighs> you know. Excellent. But uh, that's for next week's map to figure out. Yep. That is uh, next week, chat. Yay! Uh, uh, come back tomorrow for uh, Armored Core. Yay! Yay, Armored Core. Yay. Yay. All right, Daniel, please save the game before I actually click something on OBS. Click. Wait, did you save? Oh, yeah, auto saves. All right, well, there you go, chat. Welcome back to the loading screen. Welcome back to the screen. Welcome Yay. back to the communication error as well. 